Last Friday, Sunshine visited the Grenadine Island of Union, where the Union Island Tourism Board launched a calendar of events to raise awareness to tourism and also to coincide with the beginning of the tourist season. On Friday, several small businesses were on showcase at a business expo which was held at the Humalzak Square. Entrepreneurs spoke to Sunshine about their products and Caroline Samuel said that her husband started making local handmade crafts from conch shell after they were left lying around after the conch festival last year. Kathleen Samuel had her delicious coconut tarts, tasty cranberry scones, oatmeal cookies, and chocolate cakes on sale. Maria Alexander had some of her handmade crochet pieces on display and also bags and baskets that she made from recycled tin cups. Maslin Lewis and her siblings manufacture CMOS byproducts and they have three line of products which are categorized on the food and beverage, cosmetics and dietary supplements. Melissa Jellyso said that her crafts are mainly beach themed and they are made with sand and shells found on Union Island. Dorit Cooper and her business partner Dana Primer had their famous Count Shawmin on sale at the expo as well as sponge cakes, coconut sweet bread and honey mustard ham and baked bread which were quickly sold. After the expo, a short ceremony was held by the Union Island Tourism Board to introduce a new welcome sign and a cenotaph in recognition of Captain Yumalzak. So what I want to say this evening is that the team for tourism on this tourism is everyone's business. And we have to look at the, the tourism chain. You might not be directly affected by tourism, but it's your duty to protect the industry because somewhere along the tourism chain, you, you will be impacted. Reporting for Searchlight Online, I am Kimali Durant.